the quickest way to get content out. What's up folks, Johnny Valentine here with Gain Solar, bringing you some wire pulling tips. Customer was asking me, how do you pull all that wire? All right, Abe, you just set it up. Tell us what you did. Okay, wire pulling 101. You need a ladder, you need a pipe, you can run a ground rod through there for extra strength. We got a six, a six, a six, a six, an eight, an eight, and a six. No, that's an eight. Ground. And then what I do, and it's very not visible right now, but I strip about eight inches all of so I have bare copper, and I pick a lead wire. In this case, I picked the blue for the lead wire, and I cut that one, I trim that one back a little bit longer. And all the other subsequent wires hang off of that one. And then I tie myself a good strong figure eight and whatever I'm pulling, whether it's mule tape, or in this case, well rope, and uh, loop that through there, give it a good twist, and then do what's called a daisy chain, where I bend the lead wire up, and then I hook my next wire. In this case, I did these center wires first, Bend it up, hook the next wire on that, and then the wire I just hook, I bend that up too, and I hook this wire on that one. That's a lot of hooking on there. And a lot of tape. So, a like, lot of tape. get you a good support for your wire, get, get the spools, get them rolling, have somebody guiding the spools as you're pulling. Make sure it's strong enough. Like you said, he's reinforced the pipe with a ground rod. Clamp your spools on. And then we let the trunks loose on the other ends. Make sure your pipe is big enough. They've got a four inch pipe. Two inch would probably be good for this, but four inch is great. Make sure your wire's long enough too. Yeah, we got a long long pull. Yeah, make sure your wire's long enough. <laughs> However you wanna tape the wires up, you can go sit at a supply house for a couple hours and ask every electrician how to tape the wire and they're all gonna give you different answers. But you need to tape them up so they're not gonna come loose. So they're, they're like mechanically almost braided and interwoven and they're all taped to get together. Use plenty of lube when you're pulling your wires. They, they sell lube at the supply house. Uh, use a strong rope that's not gonna break. And lastly, when you're pulling, and there's a chungus. big guy on the other end of it pulling. Don't, tug of war. Pull his yeah. out. Don't, don't let him just go crazy on it like a motor. He's got bad pulling you gotta communicate. You gotta say pull. One guy's feeding the wire into the pipe. One guy's mining the spools. And one guy's just a pulling. <laughs> So those are some keys to a good pull, I'm sure. They didn't complain because they didn't see the awesome job that Abraham did on the daisy chain. Because that's critical how that, that's the most critical part of that. It's basically braided. Yeah, the only reason I'm not showing that is because the one time I went on a commercial electric job, every time it got time to pull wire, all the electricians yeah. argued about the best well, way to well, tape them up. will remain a mystery. Well, yeah. Just let, as long as they know it's not just tape. I know you explained not, it, but you can't see it. No, they're, br they're, they're, they're in looped on in on each other. There's an initial loop, and then it goes back, and then they're all looped in on each other. And that's a great way to tape it up. That's a southeastern style Sundance pull. Yeah. You know, I don't necessarily agree with it, but I'm sure all the electricians are going to have problems with it. So we'll have more video, huh? Oh, they'll be critical. So you can see that pipe's even sagging a little bit with the weight of the wire. Do we want to throw the ground rod through it? I got a ground. Oh, it is in there. Dang. So. Start pulling. Start pulling, folks. Big enough conduit. Those are my tips. Johnny Valentine with Gain Solar. Signing out.